Here are the babies this morning. They are um, four and a half weeks old. And I'm sorry you're gonna see the mess in the kitten room because they were having such a screaming meeby fit for me to pay attention to them that, come back here you, that um, I haven't cleaned up yet. They are um, out in the playpen. Come here, you can see this little one is making a run for it here. They're out in the playpen and several times a day I come in and sit on the floor and um, let them come out and play. And they all want to go explore <laughs> further than me. I've got a runner. <laughs> oh, he'll be back. That's one of um, Julie's boys. But anyway, they come out and they play and then I corral them back up um, and let them stay out of trouble then while I'm not in the room. But they get lots of play time. This is Quinley. Quinley is going to Canada. She'll be joining her, um, she'll be joining three other Burmans there. One of whom came from me several years ago. Murphy um, is a Red Point boy there. No, we stay here with Mama. But as you can, there's little bitty Red Boy, and he is growing and doing so well. He's still smaller than his brothers and sisters, but he's doing great. This is a little Seal Point. Oh, another runner. Sorry, I'm having to move around so much. Mama Julie is enjoying a minute of peace. Um, let me see if I can show you other colors. This little girl, I'm undecided if she is a chocolate or a lilac lynx point. I know she's a lynx point because you can see, oh no, I'm sorry. This is the chocolate tortie. This is Quinley. Somewhere scampering about, there is a kitten I'm trying to decide if she's a chocolate or a lilac lynx. She must be the escapee because I don't see her. Um, but they are doing so good. This is the little red boy, the little tiny one. His name, I think, is going to be Queso Flamiato. Since he's red, you can see the apricot color there on his ears. And I haven't decided on names yet for anybody else. This is a little seal lynx girl. You can see the, the white rim around her ear there. That's one of the hallmarks of a lynx point, along with a little white mustache. But they're all doing great. Growing like little weeds. You can see the seal point has a much darker um, coat. Some of this kitten coat will probably come out and they'll be lighter for a while and then will gradually darken again as they age. Here's one of the older girls, that's Princess Naya. She'll be leaving for um, California on the first. I'm not sure where her sister is right this minute. But all the babies are doing great. And I will have hopefully a regular floss tube video up. Um, it's probably gonna be next week. I've just been overwhelmed with kitten and other life stuff. So no, not much stitching done, no floss tube for a few days. Here's Queso. But they're all doing so good. Thank y'all for your prayers for them. Keep them coming. Y'all have a blessed day. God bless.